Well, now here's the other problem. There's not okay. a lot of room to work in there, and for that uh, saw you're gonna need a cut type off. unit, Clint would be I right in the middle of that line if he was down there. There's no doubt. That's a tough one. Hey, yeah. Ricky. All right, what else you got? Man, it's just an unfortunate blow for the 43, yeah. really. Um, you know, you got to be careful. Obviously, you need those threads on there trying to get the nut off. But there, these guys have been, we, you called it over-delivering. I can not agree more. Uh, the job that Eric Jones and the 43 car have been doing, but unfortunate day here. Now, this I like. Uh, an air grinder to grind it down and then a chisel to finish the job. That's how you're going to get that off there. And hopefully I mean, you, what are you don't do damage with the threads, the threads yeah, enough thinking. that you can't get another nut on. Eric Jones came in here five points below the cut line for making the playoffs in 18th place. There's the air gun and socket for when things work right. The road stays closed. Just think of the leaders that have had problems today. Christopher Bell lost a tire. Kyle Busch had a slow stop when he was the leader. Chase Elliott beat everybody off pit road but had an equipment penalty. And William Byron was leading when a tire went down. It's just become like a day of survival. Not only on the track, but but also on pit road for all that those was guys. A lug wrench, it was actually broke right there. This, this is like a, <laughs> a semi truck. That's what exactly what yeah, it is. He called it a Porsche option. That is a Peterbilt option is what that is. <laughs> <That's> <laughs> for sure. But I, I, he's trying to, I think they're trying to actually cut that stud off. Look at that. Well, this 43 team is going to get the biggest attaboy if they can get that, get a tire on that car and get him back. On the track. You're that right. tight. Hey, that's truck. That is tight. That's truck stop torture right there. You know how frustrated it is for Eric Jones sitting in the car. Uh, like, what, what is going on? Use that and at, at this point, it, it's, it's, it's probably become comical to Eric. Like, you're sitting in there, you're like, all right, that right there. That's a three-quarter drive. I believe that is the biggest breaker bar you can buy. I don't know, Mike. Amazon's got a lot of now, breaker I can tell you, with that guy holding on to it, it's the most efficient tool they have. Yep. That's a big old boy that was using <laughs> that. This cutoff wheel, I've never seen one of those before. I'm headed to the to the, to the the general store on Monday morning, yep. and I'm buying one of them. Pit Road remains closed. And Chase Elliott, the leader, 130 laps in. Uh, adding to Christopher Bell's woes, he had a 19-second pit stop under green. They had cross-threaded a wheel nut, and Jones dropped from 7th to 21st. So right now, scoring is showing 16 cars on the lead lap. And that means everybody from Ricky Stenhouse on down who made green flag pit stops one lap down still awaiting a official word on the free pass from that caution and, flag. And, and if you are a lap down right now and you made your pit stop, it, it's going to be okay because you'll get to do the, the wave around. Might be on a little bit older tires, but you're not going to be stuck a lap down because all those guys are going to pit. And Alex Bowman is the free pass. So he'll be back on the lead lap. So we have seen uh, stuck center lock nuts before uh, this season. We've seen cross threaded nuts. We've not seen anything like this. Yeah, you can see every pit crew member. I mean, we're all watching it, right? Everybody's wanting to know uh, not only what the problem is, but how they're going to fix, fix it. it. Yeah, what, what do we need for the next time this happens? 100%. And it seemed like they're actually fairly prepared. You, you talked about the, the massive impact gun that they had down there because this has been a little bit of an issue, but we haven't seen anything like this. And here, my tool of choice would be that grinder. That, uh, that reciprocating you, saw doesn't have enough room to get in there and I, I work like, the way that wheel is I feel is like dished. you pulled a clint on me, though. You kind of This right here you, is my you, tool of choice. Bar. That guy right there, he can get the job done. <laughs> Eric Jones' crew ranks uh, high in our eBay Motors pit crew ratings. And... Uh, Here's the best on pit road after 12 races.
Kyle. You see the driver rank. I mean, that's one part of the equation. Driver's got to do a good job coming on and off pit road, getting in and out of the box, and then the crew, Jamie. There's Eric Jones' group in the top 10 for pit stop time. Yeah, we talked about, you know, issues with loose wheels, and, and nobody on that list had had a loose wheel or earlier in, in or during the season. So not only have they been good getting on and off pit road, fast pit stops, but they haven't had the mistakes. Now, once they get that nut off, the question will be, do they still have enough good threads there to get a new nut on and secured? I, I guess you got to cross that bridge when you get to it. you got to get across gotta get this one first. first. Yeah. I mean, they look at that. Yeah, they're going to now. Gonna cut here the we wheel go. Off. We're going to cut the wheel to get access to cut yeah. the nut. The dish of the wheel is preventing them from getting that saw in there, so they're just going to cut the wheel out. He's lost four laps so far trying to work on this. So pit road will be open this time now that NASCAR has sorted out the scoring of cars that pitted prior to the caution flag versus those that didn't. Alex Bowman will get the free pass. Definitely could not have come at a worse time when the four spun coming off of pit road. Pit stops were halfway 